Welcome guys to a new series on our channel and we are doing another skyblock but it ain't project sacrifice this is sky revolutions and guess there's some law you woke up and realized the whole world is gone you are you have just a small island under your feet you think maybe a second page could send some more information law information in the, in the last of question in each chapter okay <coughs> so you woke up you might wonder where you are you got chosen as my test subject to see how advanced can humans beings get you got teleported to another universe if you want to get out you need to create the most advanced thing our civilization achieved the vibration machine mechanism if you manage to create one i'll get you out of here okay what's this start what is this it's here. the pack is an thanks to almost lacking of grind so you have some time to build and enjoy your creations i really hope you like this pack have fun i will so let's see what the first bit is okay so pebble so we need a pebble and living roots so how you get pebbles is your shift right click ground and i believe yeah there's living roots but i don't want to break it because there's nothing underneath so man. so here we are i mean so if you shift right click you can get it quite easily the pebbles but if you have an auto clicker like mine you can get them more faster but if you just make it a bit faster that should be good enough Got, got some new recipe with the pebbles there's two things you can make a book or cobblestone and we need cobblestone but instead of going like that and you know in this mod if you press k or craft it into its thing and i believe shift k will do everything this is really good huh. and then Luckily, this mod has forgiveness for it, I think, or I can't remember what it's called. But it's a mod that allows you to basically fall off or not revive it, stay alive and not lose everything. And there's no fall damage. So we don't end up on half a heart like we would with Project Sacrifice. <laughs> So, this mod is a bit of a mix of everything almost. It's got crates, it's got uh, most of engineering. Let me just show you quest book. So, we've got some crates here. Most of engineering, and then we start on a lot of stuff. But what I'm more excited about is this Botania. This is a mod that I've tried to play a few times, but just can never really get into it. Oops. Three, yeah. Because it's not bad, but it's just hot. And I believe just hold on that this quest book we don't need to have on us if we go to controls key binds quest open quests uh, let's just set that to X because it's nice and close key binds I believe if we do X like that 
I'll change that to X. So let's make that G. What's G set to? Okay. <laughs> button four. There we go. It's a button on my mouse. Why did that take so long? Unfortunately, it seems like we've kind of here, so we'll just do something like that. Here we go. Let's see what we need. So, the introduction we got living room, so we've got pips, we also make cobblestone. So, we need gravel, which is the general hammer, I believe, apothecary, which is stone and one of the flowers, I think. Okay. So, a sapling. How do we make a sapling? Living root. So, I believe this is a, yeah, a shapeless crafting recipe. What else can living root? Okay. So, it can only be made into that. Then, what's... Just trying to see... There's a certain mod that I can't remember which keybind I've said. Okay, yeah. It's just a build mod that helps build stuff quicker. It's fine for now. It's actually easier without it. Okay. And I believe you yeah, do have to work. There we go. And it should be frost leaves, DK. Oh my. I just lost a ton of stuff. Luckily I can just grab some more of here. This just acts as a light source. Uh, you can keep it if you want, but I personally don't like it. Let's see. So, a barrel, dirt, that could be quite good. Then, crystal water, and sieves. Oh, that could be quite good to get into. Composters. Okay, okay. Okay. Oops, I did not mean to do that. That was just a waste of wood. <laughs> okay, anyways. We need a axe. Then, I believe a crook. Yeah. Then how do we make... What's it? The barrel, crucible, compost, and stuff. So... Compost is easy. Um, uh, maybe oak barrel. Oak barrel, which is just here. So, okay. So, we need quite a few slabs. For composter and barrel. Wait, what was this thing that just popped up? Oh, that's quite cool. Then we need a serve. What do they call it? Oak serve. From spawn. Which is. Okay, can make that easier enough. And I want a few more of those because we can make bigger areas, which would be really good. Like so. Like that. Okay. Then a crucible. Uh, oak. One wood. There we 
go. I quite like how they quickly disappear. Okay. So, oak barrel. I believe you put stuff in here. And it will turn into dirt. Then, oh, we've got some new stuff. So, tin pad, we can explore a bit later. That basically just like makes stuff um, where you can teleport to it. Man. This here, temporal pouch. Oops. Yeah. So, if it's in your inventory, it will store up time. Then you can use it to make blocks accelerate faster. So, just for an example, you can make that accelerate to there. <coughs> and it should grow faster, but for certain stuff, yeah. And then you need oak crystal that. Okay. <coughs> then, a cool thing of Britannia is if you get the. Oh, yeah make a bucket there we go then I can pick up the water then four more just one full up that Oops. I mean <laughs> that will give us a full water source This also works, okay. That is. Oh! I am not the smartest. <laughs> okay. Let me. Wait. Then, for the serves, uh, we need string, which is done by your open be able to get silkworms and this is very similar to most of the other ones where it takes a few shots. Okay, until they all grow you take your silkworms and you plant them around After some time, the whole tree will become this color. And I think here's the best. So you see how this one's 9%? See how quickly it's going than other stuff? These went at the same time. And, and then with auto mine, I can just mine almost all the string, get a whole bunch of silkworms back, and string. Yeah. Hmm. I just... Cat's trying to climb up my bed. So... Let me see. I'm gonna... Get... A whole bunch... I'm gonna get enough for... Nine... Oak serves. I'm gonna just build a little platform over here and I'll be right back. After a bit of tree chopping and just harvesting string and getting cobblestone, I decided let's try this out. So, we've got gravel now. I'm only gonna do sand, then dust. Yeah. So, I wanna keep some other things. This is going to be really silly, but there's no full damage, so it's fun. Then if we break this down, we've got dust. Nice. Then, what you can do with this gravel is, with a sieve, you can sieve it down into resources. Particularly, Flint. <laughs> Wait, I don't even remember placing that tree. Because then, with a flint mesh, if I can 
uh, here, gravel gives you all these ores, which we need a lot of iron and flints, in fact. Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna spend some time doing that. Just I'm gonna see how many we can get. I'm slowly expanding this island, and I'm gonna build something around. And I'll get back to you guys once I've done some stuff. Let's go. And after a little bit of time, guys, and a lot of auto clicking, we managed to build this nice platform. And I completely forgot there's the mod storage drawers, which we've played a bit around with. And I love this mod because you can hold a lot of items. Just take a look at my wood. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> there's a lot of dirt I needed here. But anyways, let's get into this. So, we need this for fertilizer. Because for this pedal apothecary, let's see. Pe Just search about the here. Yeah. Pet. You see, we need one of these petals. And these petals, oh, flower, even I think, is made from Botania's actual flowers. And the only way to get that is through floral fertilizer. And that is with four pieces of some dye and a piece of bone meal. So this is one of the shapeless recipes, no matter how ordered it is, so long as there's four dyes and bone meal, you get that. Now let's see. Um, I believe there's, there's a pouch, let me just see here. Pouch. It should be a flower pouch, yeah. Okay, so let's see if we can. There we go. Get some flowers. And just see this flower pouch. It's a petal. So these flowers, if you, let's just say this gray one, we put it in, you get two petals. Then you can plant them. If we can just and then you break them and they become these tall grey flowers which give you even more so let's see just all right or yeah because then if I check these down They should all go into here. Nice. Then for the apothecary, do we have enough? It's just cobblestone. Like that, I believe. Petal. There we go. So, pure white daisy, pure white daisy, or pure daisy, mm. pure daisy, there we go, okay, so we piece of dust, white dye, and white petals, were we lucky enough to get any, no, unfortunately not, but I believe, yes this stuff can be made into dyes so if i just plant a little bit down and break them then i can take all but one 
make into petals, make into dye, and make more. Just like that. So this is what's nice. Once you, the botania, once you like start getting into it, you like really get into it. So I'm gonna do this a little bit to see if we can get some white flowers, and I'll be right back. And after a little bit of time and me just running around making a whole bunch of these tall flowers, I have one of every color. We finally got the petals needed. So we need one white dust. Then we've got that and we should have some dust here. Yes. Let's make this flower. How do you do you huh? Must I chuck them in or just go like that maybe? After a little bit of like, searching I finally found it. And I thought it was this, where's my it shows it's empty, but you actually need water. Then we can add that's right. Oh man, we need a seed, and there's our pure white daisy. Then, how it works is let's grab some stone, cobblestone, weird. If you surround it, do you have a pickaxe? Yeah, I need an axe. Man. There we go. You could hear it a little bit in the background. And this makes living rock. Which we'll need for our next little thing. But as well, if we add wood down, this will make living wood. Now, living rock, we can make mana pool, which is like that. And what we could do is, I believe it's called a diluted mana pool. Diluted mana pool, yes. Which is like this. So it doesn't hold as much mana as the other one, which is going to be good for us. Okay, then we need magic wand, which I believe is that, and we just twig, then yeah, three of those, and we need two flowers. I believe any two works, tall or small. Or do they have to be petals? Probably. And this will, the color of the one will vary on what the petals are, doesn't matter. And as you can see here, same crafting recipe just has a whole bunch of other stuff. So if you don't know, that's how. Let's get some more mana wood, more living wood, and let's see, mana spreader we need. Okay, so how do we make a mana spreader? Mana spreader. Okay, so seven of them with petal in the middle. Perfect. Luckily we have that, and then that, and that. Do you want to check something? This pedal. Can I? No. 
but I might just place a block of dirt somewhere here so that's out of the way okay so these things they they vary on how close they are the matter goes leave right there so sometimes they'll automatically connect if not you can just right click and shift right click and point it at that thing so that's connected to that as you can see then for the end of the chapter we need and the site but I believe we need this end of flip because see and uh, site uh, so we can make a few ways with create but I'm there okay so we we need chuck cobblestone in and that as you can see there it uses a very tiny bit okay but we need our mana pool to have some stuff in it so uh, and then in do flame let's just hit that so two brown a red i believe we have all of that where's our pouch yeah we've got brown a red and gray let's just grab that one and there we are and what's it two brown and one of those okay take one of our trusty bowls of water two one one and luckily we got a extra seat and there we go so how i believe this works let's see if we can ponder no huh anyways um if i'm correct is you just give it a fuel source and there we go and this bag since we've got an hour and a half we can just accelerate that to a high speed and then there we go okay so that's how it works and my i've just lost an hour for speeding it up to that much but we got quite a bit of andesite but i think the problem is we burnt all the coal so we wasted a whole bunch of time yeah but now that we have this let's see so we could go into the industrial revolution and start with crates but there's still a few things we have to finish here what's this tome 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 is it just pebble okay pebble no clue it, do we weird let's see if the quest book says anything book that can book that holds books you can put all books and documents inside of it for quick and easy access wait does that mean we can how do we no clue let's just put that away some of the stuff then snad this is a one of my favorite mods i believe wait um snad there we go so it basically makes it grow faster than regular sand and i don't think they have any more but you could used to be able to put a lever on it a lever sorry and like rapid click it 
and okra and stuff instantly. Okay, then let's see. Last one. A pot. Oh, this pot, yes. So, bonsai pots. On. Wait. Is it? Yeah. Bonsai pots. I believe. How do we make clay? Is it. Yeah. So, this is quite a cool feature. Which would be cool to have in games. Um, wait. What happened? So, I believe in a. Wait, let me. Let me just make some uh, extra water source. But good. There we go. Oh, I can get rid of those. And. If I, there we go. So I'm not sure. Put in the wrong one in this. A crystal? Huh? Maybe. Oh, they right click. Okay. And that gets us that. So we need five for the. Oops. Five for just the terracotta and one for the one bit for the pot. What I see is from the unfortunate is our bucket has limited use, which is kind of sad. I'll put that there, that there, that in. So that should, yeah. Just making sure I didn't do something wrong. And then I did do a bit of sifting, some gravel and that, and we got these iron pieces, which four of them make a raw iron, which we cook. These can't do anything else with, unfortunately. But if we cook some of these, how far you? That's good. Flower pot. Uh, just get it going faster there. And that should almost be there. So, and that. There we go. These are really good. Because if I place them down somewhere, add. Oh, I'll just put snad in. You see, I can add snad in whatever grows on there but what I'm gonna do is if you take iron and make a hopper like so and add it in you make a hopper one tree pot then using one of the you just Jaws, we need a two by two jaw, yeah. There we go. If we place one of those down, put that, uh, let's just get some dirt real quick. then we can place that in and we can place the little guy in. so this would grow and when it's manual once it's grown you have to right click it with an axe but like this as you can see or or automatic or automatically chop it down and then put it into here and we'll get a whole bunch of things you are taking a while so so I can show you guys there we go so nothing else is stored yet 
Kim. Okay. I think I might just be getting unlucky to not get these. But anyways, it's just so it can go all of those. And this can run while we're doing other stuff. So I think that's where we're going to end it today, guys. I really hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys next episode. Bye-bye now.